I think it's a meditation week. I'm getting questions all about meditation. So the next question is, what is the science behind meditation? I received it from Geneva again. The science behind meditation is revealed in various ways by medical sciences. Its profound effects on the brain and body supported by extensive research in neuroscience and psychology is no longer hidden from anyone. So few of the scientific findings I'll share with you today. So brain structure and function neuroplasticity. Meditation can actually change the brain structure. It is a phenomenon known as neuroplasticity. Studies using MRI scans have shown increased gray matter density in areas related to memory, learning, emotional regulation, and perspective building. You know, such as the, the part which is hippocampus and prefrontal cortex. Then, you know, amygdala, we know about it. So regular meditation reduces the signs and reactivity of amygdala. It's the brain region associated with the stress and fear. So this helps in lowering stress levels and enhancing emotional regulation. Now you know why meditation is so effective on stress. Now default mode network DMN. Meditation can decrease activity in the DMN, which is responsible for mind wandering and self-referential thoughts. So which means a less active DMN is associated with improved focus and reduction in anxiety and depression. There are physiological effects as well of stress reduction. So meditation activates the parasympathetic nervous system. You know, it promotes relaxation, basically, simply. So this leads to lower levels of cortisol, which is the stress hormone, reducing overall stress and its harmful effects on the body. It also improves immune function. So meditation can boost the immune system. And the research indicates that increased activity of natural killer cells and enhanced antibody response making the body more resilient to infections and diseases and pain you know pain management is another aspect of meditation because it can alter the perception of pain it engages brain areas involved in pain processing such as the anterior cingulate cortex and enhances the brain's ability to modulate pain signals reducing the subjective experience of pain how beautiful is it isn't it and then comes cognitive and emotional benefits attention and focus i just mentioned it few minutes ago right about the focus thing so meditation improves attention span and focus and you know studies have shown that even brief periods of meditation can enhance your cognitive performance and the ability to sustain attention on tasks just imagine how powerful it is and then you know it also takes care of emotional regulation so which means that meditation enhances emotional regulation by increasing the activity in brain areas responsible for emotion regulation you know such as the prefrontal cortex reducing activity in the amygdala so all these things leads to better control over your emotional responses and greater emotional resilience what else can anyone want in this case then right it also is ready to help you with your enhanced well-being so meditation is linked to increased levels of positive emotions uh, life satisfaction and uh, overall well-being so it can reduce symptoms of anxiety depression other mental health conditions contributing to a more balanced fruitful purposeful and fulfilling life we all knew it but you know now science backs it up as well so science behind meditation reveals its ability to induce significant changes in the brain structure and function actually it does that enhance physiological health improve cognitive and emotional well-being all these benefits are supported by a growing body of empirical research making meditation a powerful tool for mental and physical health so what are you waiting for learn it do it practice it teach it 
everything that you do around meditation is going to give you uh, the satisfaction and a fulfilled living as well you want to learn it thoroughly with the complete concepts and practicality of it then join personal masteries mindfulness meditation facilitator course you will get it all from us so yeah so these are the uh, sciences behind meditation i hope i am able to answer the question i bet i am and see you soon